Good day everyone, you are welcome to my channel. I am Giva Alim Kende. In today's class, our subject is physics and I will take you through light waves. Topic outline. Today's class, I will be treating concept of light, object and light properties, reflection, refraction, and color. Lesson objective. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to divine light ray, list and explain different types of objects, explain reflection and refraction, and list the colors in light spectrum. What is light? Light is an electromagnetic radiation within the portion of the electric spectrum that can be perceived by the human eyes. Let me take that again. Light is an electromagnetic radiation within the portion of the electromagnetic spectrum that can be perceived by the human eye. Note, perceived by the human eyes. And note another word, electromagnetic spectrum. Spectrum, what does it mean? You will know today. Light is produced by sun and by objects such as light bulb. And light travels at a speed of 300 million meters per second. Have you ever wondered how light comes from sun when sun is far away from us and yet it brights our environment? Light waves travel in straight lines. Light waves travel in straight lines. Extending our knowledge on light, light is an electromagnetic field as I've said earlier. Now, objects. Different objects about light. Number one, luminous objects. Number two, non-luminous objects, opaque objects, transparent and translucent objects. What do they mean? Luminous objects are objects that gives out or produces light in its contents, such as light bulb or the sun. Non-luminous objects are objects that does not give out light. Light has to be shined on such object before eyes can see it or before they can be visible to human eyes. Example is comb, wood, if they are not made in a transparent manner or if they are not made with luminous objects. Looking at a good example of luminous object is that beautiful girl holding a torch light. A torch light is an example of luminous object because they produce light. Other objects we, talk, we want to talk about are opaque objects, and these are objects that does not allow the passage of light through them. And when light shines on them, they form what we know as shadow. Transparent are uh, objects that allows light to pass through them almost completely, and translucent are uh, objects that allow light to pass through them partially but doesn't allow them to pass through them completely like transparent objects. Let's look at reflection. What is reflection? Reflection can be conceptualized as a light that bounces off an object when the light strikes the surface of an object. The ray that bounces back from the surface is called light ray. And this is a one of the phenomena how we are able to view or see objects. Objects that reflect light well are objects that have smooth, shiny surfaces and are usually of pale colors, as seen in that diagram. Just imagine this man riding bicycle at night is wearing only black clothes and a, a, a car full light shines on him. It won't be as bright as what we have here because he's wearing a stripe of green, red and white strip. It makes him more visible. And clearer than only when he's wearing a black cloth and this is these are what we meant by smooth shiny surfaces and usually of pale colors refraction refraction is the bending of wave when it enters a medium where its speed is different the refraction of light when it passes from a fast medium to a slow medium bends the light Bends the light ray and refraction is responsible for image formation by lenses 
and the eyes. Color. Light ray is a combination of seven different colors called light spectrum. The visible spectrum is always the same for a rainbow color. And we have them in this order. We have red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. And we have them in that content. Also, you can arrange them in violet, indigo, blue, green, yellow, orange, and red. Summary of our class today. Light ray travels on a straight line at a speed of 300 million meters per second. Some object allows the total passage of light, some partially, and some does not allow the passage of light. Like, opaque object doesn't allow the passage of light. Light ray can be reflected or refracted. This phenomenon dictates the forming of image in lenses or eyes. I will be leaving you with some assignments. Number one, list colors of light spectrum in its order. Number two, list the properties of a surface with high reflective power. And three, explain why object looks bent in water. Kindly submit your answers via training at educom.ng. Thank you for listening.